Hello Virgos, how are you doing? I hope you guys are doing marvelous. Let's see what's going on with your energy at this time. Let's see what's taking place. All right. Um, and before I start, thank you for all of your likes and subscriptions and all of that greatness. All right. Especially for all your support. Okay. Let's see what's going on. If you're interested in a personal reading, all of my information is below where we could go one-on-one -on -one in depth and see what's going on with you and your person. All right. All right. Let's see what's going on. Virgos, please. All right, I'm in the middle of making a decision. I'm in the middle of making a decision here, right? Where it's, should I continue to look into this situation or should I move forward here? Should I text this person? Should I reach out to this person? It's like, I check my phone, but I don't feel like this person's giving me exactly what it is that I may be looking for here, okay? Someone's feeling like it's decision time here, all right? For some of you, there may be two options or there's two people that you're trying to make a decision uh, towards at this time, okay? Two of wands here, decision time, all right? I feel like someone may be connecting with someone here um, that may or may not be able to make a decision when it comes to love or the way that they communicate is a bit off here right? We have the Empress energy. I feel like you are moving towards this energy of really understanding yourself, Virgo, really loving yourself, but I'm still trying to figure out how does this person not understand that, right? Am I not expressing it? I don't get it. But I feel like, again, there's this energy of you wanting to truly love yourself, trying to find balance, trying to find that equal um, give and take here within yourself more so right? I'm going towards what it is that I'm looking for. There's a strong energy of really just wanting to um, nurture and love someone. But at some point, I feel like someone here was either taking it for granted or they weren't really giving you what you were giving in this connection here. All right. Pisces, Cancer energy, Taurus as well. All right. Uh, yeah. Taurus energy. Okay. But again, there's a lot of love in your energy, and I feel like you have so much love to give, Virgo. But it's a matter of who am I going to give it to and who am I connecting with? There's something about you also learning about yourself at this time, okay? Work energy, of course, right? I'm working, I'm working on myself. I'm working on getting to know me, right? But I'm also connecting with someone that I really feel strong towards here. I feel the strong pull towards but can we work something out here? Is is there a possibility that we could make this connection work here? Could we move towards this Ten of Cups that's popping up here, right? But again, someone may be moving very, very slow. And I feel like this person may be uh, protecting themselves, right? Hiding a lot of their emotions, be uh, being very aloof here. This person could have someone else, all right? Or you have someone else. But again, can we work this out and if so, will I be loved here? Okay, someone just feels highly neglected by somebody. Okay, but again, wanting to move towards a higher level of love here, right? Wanting to, I feel like you know what you want. <laughs> I feel like it's like I want love, right? I, I really want to connect with this person. Oh, look at all this. Look at what we have here. Hold on, let's see. I truly want to connect with this person, but I don't feel like this person is truly giving in to this connection, okay? We have Capricorn energy here, okay? Someone here that may be um, constantly acting like everything is fine in love, right? Virgo, there's someone in your energy here that I feel like they're, they've been hurt in love here a lot. And I feel like because of that, you know, there's a lot of fears here how they communicate, how they open up, even if, you know, when they choose to open up more so. But I feel like someone here is acting like everything's okay, everything is fine, I love myself, you know? And I feel like you were very nurturing and loving to this person, all right? But I feel like, again, there's a lot of fears. This person has definitely been hurt here in the past, okay? So let's see what else is going on, all right? Let's see what's taking place with you at this time, Virgos. Virgos. Let's get an overall energy for this connection, please. Overall energy for my Virgos. Thank you. Wow. 
two of wands again. So someone here can't make a decision. Either you're in or you're out. Let me know what it is. Like, what is it going to be? Who sings that song? I think Buster Ron Janet Jackson. Like, what is it going to be? Like, are you in or are you out? Okay. I feel like one minute this person is open and they're ready to talk and they're present and then next, they're not here. For some of you, there may be this relationship that you're unsure about here, okay? Where you may be dealing with two people. It's like, what is it that I truly want? Either you feel like this about your person where you don't understand uh, what it is that they want or you're unsure of what it is that you want. But I do get this energy of high you know, uncertainty here. The two of wands. Even the way this person communicates, it's like I'm unsure what this person's looking for. I have a lot of love for them, right? And it's interesting because I feel like there's a lot of, I like I've opened up to this person, right? I've truly opened up for, to this person, but I don't feel like they're reciprocating, okay? Bottom of the deck here, we have the Six of Swords. I've tried to research. I tried different things to try to get out of this situation peacefully. Um, you could deal with someone that maybe, uh, you know, they like to spy, right? Watching you online, keeping, keeping you know, tabs on you at time or, um, or when they're at their computer, they're watching you. Something about them being on their computer and watching you. All right. Take that again, how that resonates for a lot of you at this time. I feel like this person tries to do background checks on you. <laughs> right or this could be you but i feel like this person also tells you that they're busy like i have a lot of things going on someone here may be stuck in a situation and it's like i don't know how to get out this is becoming a lot for me whether your person's in a situation or you're in a situation or even you're in this situation and i'm literally trying to get out of this because i do not feel like there is that equal give and take here I feel like this person has an energy of coming off very calm, all right? Calm, cool, and collective. This person may like to travel here. We have the maps in the background, or this person may be from a different location. Whatever it may be, someone here doesn't know how to come out of a situation, basically, okay? I'm unsure how to come out of this. And this person also wants to know how you feel about them as well, okay? Temperance. This person has a lot of patience here, a lot of patience, yeah, this person may not be listening to their intuition, I see. Okay, so let's get some more messages here and see what's going on. Mm, yeah, some someone feels trapped in a situation emotionally, right? And it's due to this energy of how someone here is communicating. Like, I feel like this person's not communicating. This person could be um, someone that, you know, tends to lie about their, you know, what they're doing, why they're not present, why they're not available, but they're still watching you. Spy. I'm telling you, this person's such a spy. This person's watching you all the time. Or this could be you, Virgo. Just someone's watching someone here. Big time. I'm watching you. I try to see how you feel about me. I try to see how you feel before I tell you how I feel. So I watch, I spy. I keep an eye on you. I'm always thinking about you, right? I think about your love. I think about the way that we connected here because you're my person. Awakening. Someone here is starting to realize that someone here has been a bit aloof. It's like I'm starting to realize that this is something that I need to make a decision in here. Okay, clarify the Empress energy. Unstable. Mm, Virgos, what is going on? Oh, I feel like someone here isn't loving themselves enough. Which is why we have this indecision. I feel like there's going to be this energy of, okay, epiphany, right? It's like I'm, I'm awakening to the fact that I've been, you know, throwing myself under the bus for this person, right? Where this person could have a very lustful-like energy. Someone here doesn't know exactly what they want. I feel like someone here wasn't treating this empress with love, with respect, with kindness and compassion at some time, especially when it came to her emotions. All right? Not gender specific, please. All right? Patience here. 
I was very patient with them. I was loving with them here. I was very loving, right? I felt this person was my soulmate. I feel like they are my soulmate. How is this person? Let me see how this person's feeling. I'm sorry. This person owes you an apology for something, right? For how they treated you, how they dismissed you for whatever reason. Okay. I feel like you're finding yourself. Like I literally feel this energy of I'm finding myself, but I'm afraid of what the outcome may be. Right? I'm afraid that I may not be able to come out of my situation or I won't be able to find some sort of resolution in this situation. Because I feel like someone here has been trying to come out of a situation for some time. Okay. How is this person feeling about my Virgos? I'm hiding how I feel about you. I hide it. I hide it all the time. Right? Because I may have secrets or I'm just not ready to tell you. I'm just not ready to tell you how I feel. Bottom of the deck, we have conflict, incompatibility, and differences. You may not understand where I'm coming from when I tell you that I may be afraid or if I tell you what my past is like. There's something that this person is not telling you here. Could still be attached to some sort of mother child's mother here or uh an ex to some extent there's secrets here or this person's unstable because they got hurt in a past situation or this person's viewing you as somebody that may be unstable in the way that you're loving yourself okay just take that how that resonates right just chuck the ones that don't resonate but again there's this fear here moving forward okay how does my virgos feel Okay, intimacy. I feel the closeness with this person, but I feel like this person may be a bit superficial. You feel like this person may be superficial. You're getting bored. I'm getting bored of the, you know, the repeating cycle here. It's like I want to be close with this person, right? I love the intimacy. I love the conversations here. I've been hoping and waiting and manifesting for this person to open up. But I'm starting to realize that this person may be very fearful here. All right. I feel like there's some energy that's coming into this reading of someone here deciding to move towards fear of, I don't know if I want to open up anymore, or I don't know if I want to love anymore. I'm just so afraid. Or I'm going to repeat this cycle of not believing that there's love here. Someone's, I feel like someone here is giving up overall energy for that. Memories, the memories, the bittersweet memories is what's, you know, putting this energy of fear here. Like I'm so afraid of loving again, right? I'm afraid of repeating my past. My past keeps replaying in my mind of how I was rejected, how I was lied to, how I spent so many years hoping and wishing that things would work out but they didn't in this past situation i couldn't make a decision for myself here someone here is allowing their memories to really dictate their future and i feel like it's now putting them in this position of avoiding true intimacy avoiding true love i'm just afraid right i'm blocking i'm escaping i'm running from it because of the memories okay and I feel like there needs to be this self-harmony or this soul growth here that needs to come in, right? I need to really nurture myself at this time, okay? Let's get some messages here. I got three cards. Yeah. Someone here is not really being honest, okay? Can you give me more for this two of wands? Clarify this two of wands for me. What we have for this two of wands? I opened up to this person and they rejected me. Or I feel like they're rejecting me after I opened up so much to this person. Someone here is afraid of opening up. Maybe dealing with someone that's afraid of opening up here, Virgo. It's like for you, for some, or whoever is watching me, it's like I opened up to this person, but I feel like they rejected me. They weren't fair. 
they weren't fair justice here they weren't fair they didn't want to balance things out with me there may be a relationship going on in here as well and i feel like someone here created some sort of boundaries right after they found out about a relationship or someone just came out of a relationship that just wasn't working out for them at this time let's get some messages what kind of messages do we have here with this situation what are the beautiful messages for my virgos and irreplaceable the way you love could never be matched okay the way you love could never be matched okay i feel like someone here is honestly understanding the love that you tried to give here because i feel like there was an attempt of i want to love you with the empress energy but someone here just didn't know how to reciprocate that back we have mend i want to fix this okay what else do we have here we have new chapter i'm trying to move on from my past i'm trying to let that go big time i'm really trying to let it go and i want to fix our connection because i know my past has ruined this here ego i let my pride get in the way of our connection so it could be dealing with someone that just has a huge ego but in their spare time they're spying you know they're spying and we have third party there were other things that got in the way of us being together right it doesn't have to be someone it could be kids work school what, whatever it is especially work, right? Whatever the excuse was that this person used, right? Whatever it was, just not responding, not communicating here. Give me one more, please, from my Virgos. Inseparable. Our love is always there despite the distance. And one more. Secrets. I have secrets about my feelings. Self-love. I'm still trying to heal. Someone here is, you know, I feel like they're in this place where it's like I've been hurt before and I'm afraid of telling you the truth. And my ego has gotten in the way of this connection multiple times, multiple times. All right. I hope this resonated with you and I will talk to you soon again. If you're interested in a personal reading, all of my information is below. I love you.